Welcome to this first training video in the Getting Started series for Inside PC LAN, the desktop. The purpose of this video is to familiarize you with the Inside Desktop, its tools and functions. The desktop represents the working area of the program with its tools and support functions for the document research. So let's look at the desktop and see how we can work with it. First, let's close the open document and notice that the document library will always open by default to provide the opportunity to open another document. Remember that we can resize the frame size of the program by dragging any corner of the application. The desktop now reveals the function buttons, tabs and tools only, with the associated workspace available to receive the document. The icon button is the first resource center where functions are held. Clicking on it will open the menu of options. Here we have the open library option. Next, a close document option. A remove a title from your library option in the case where you no longer need a specific document in the library. Next we have the update functions which provides access to the update wizard. Updating the program and a license applicator if any document license has expired. The desktop option allows any of the tab functions to be accessed. We have an exit the program option and on the frame there is a button to open the program configuration function. Next to the icon button we have simple tool buttons to open the library, close a document, Maximize the Workspace button which removes the toolbar from View and a Close the Program button. Above the toolbar are the program's function tabs. The first tab is the Library and Document View window. The next is the Information System which provides basic data access. Next is the Web Page View tab which will bring the Data Dynamics website into view if connection to the Internet is available. Last is the Help Desk tab from where all functions in the Inside program are dealt with extensively. These tabs are repeated at the bottom of the desktop frame for convenience. Next, let us look at the toolbar. All the program function options are represented here. First we have the Open Library button once the library is open, any title highlighted in the list may be open for viewing and research. The search button will open the search wizard, but clicking on the black arrow provides a slide option to select the quick search tool or the search wizard. The page export tool provides a function that allows selected pages to be exported to HTML format. These pages may then be printed or included in any other software where the data may be displayed as required. The Word Index tool is a smart search function that allows the words listed in the document in a highlighted format for reference. The Update Register brings a table to screen that shows all updates made to the document in history by month and year. The Version Report tool will list the validity of each document in the library. Each update may then be selected for separate view. The Download Manager is a wizard tool that assists with the updating the library with the latest updates issued by Data Dynamics. A connection to the Internet will be required for this operation. The Desk tool provides options to arrange documents on the desktop if more than one document is being viewed. The Page Tool button provides navigation options to the documents in view. There is also a Page Detail function that will assist with identifying document currency as well as a word identifier on the page in view. Last, we have the Workspace area of the program which will contain the actual document frames which are open from the library. Here, open documents will be read in or sorted into the desired view options if more than one document is opened. This concludes the desktop tutorial of the Inside Document Browser. To learn more, please continue with the next tutorial 
video on your educational series disc or visit the webpage to access the next in the Getting Started series of training videos. Thank you for watching this Getting Started video.